Good morning, folks. Welcome, observers. Today, we're looking at a solar storm from the coronal hole stream impact, tropical development in the Atlantic, an interesting study on galactic forcing of evolution, and we're starting, as always, with the last 24 hours on our star. Where things were mostly quiet following the incoming limb eruptive event we saw yesterday morning, no significant solar flares, but of course, we were waiting for solar storm impact, and we got it. Few new sunspots we'll be monitoring, but which haven't started flaring yet, so let's go to the solar wind. Normal plasma speed around 400 kilometers per second jumped up to 700 kilometers per second, with intermittent jumps up near to 800. This is considerably faster than what was expected, and it drove higher than forecast geomagnetic storm activity. Level 1, maybe level 2 storms were forecast, but we nearly hit KP7, a level 3 storm. While normally when this type of forecast is exceeded, there's not really a good explanation other than Earth's weakening magnetic field, but the experts didn't expect this fast of a solar wind stream, so in this case, it's not entirely peculiar. Hope you got to see the northern lights last night. Heading to the tropics, there's an 80% chance of formation for this low wave heading west across the equatorial Atlantic. We have eyes open on it later this week as we may begin forecasting and tracking the next hurricane. Top science news today hit the drive of new species cosmic rays due to galactic magnetic field exposure. They say that at times in history when cosmic rays spike, we also got tons of new microbes and species. This is something we and people like Robert Felix have hypothesized confidently for years, now confirmed. And we are entering that period of higher space energy now amidst the ongoing magnetic pole shift. Speaking of which, hope you caught our video last night answering the somewhat trivia question we put in yesterday morning's show. If you didn't get a chance to see it, just click my name, Space Weather News, to go to the channel page and find that video from last night. Folks, we had a couple cancellations, so there are a few spots left in the experience this October. Sorry, ladies, these are spots in the men's section, so the last few spots do need to be men. This is the program that teaches you how to be hard as a coffin nail, unbreakable in the disaster event, physically, spiritually, psychologically. Special link is below. Go there, click the exploding sun, and watch the video. And then there's this, folks. My partner Bailey insists that once a year we do a first month free for our e-magazine observer review. The twice a month publication next comes out this afternoon. And right now, you have the ability to sign up and receive it for free. No dues until the second month. Hugely important articles this month as well. Link for that is below. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.